Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Ming Chen from AMC's Comic Book Men, and you should like, subscribe, watch, then tell all your other friends to like and subscribe, Comic Insider. All right, what's up, YouTube, Facebook? How y'all doing tonight? This is TK from Comic Insider. Hope you're all having a great Tuesday night. So, yeah, uh, we had a couple announcements tonight, and then we're going to be talking about the Spider-Man Far From Home movie review. So, yeah, and if you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. You know, like, you know, like, subscribe, share these videos. Uh, we're on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, so check that out. And, uh, well, about to be on Instagram, but, yeah, so uh, a couple announcements tonight, which is, uh, I thought it's pretty cool, is, um, yeah, uh, so some stuff happened, and uh, we're going to be, uh, I didn't announce this in the Comic-Con episode, you know, uh, video we did a couple weeks back, but, uh, yeah, because a lot of Comic-Cons we get offers to, and a lot of them that we would love to go to, but sometimes, you know, expenses and all that, and you make them sometimes, sometimes you can't, yada yada, but yeah, for all of our New Orleans fans, yeah, we're going to be back out in NOLA, so Comic Insider... We are going to be at the Big Easy Con. That's going to be from November 1st to the 3rd. Y'all got to check that event out. There's going to be so much of our, uh, you know, great, you know, celebrity friends that are going to be out there. We're going to be out there with Ming Chen, you know, a good bud of ours. Uh, a lot of people, a lot of our friends from the uh, CW of ours, uh, you know, some of our friends from DC and even Marvel are going to be out there, so... It's going to be an epic event, and Comic Asari, you know we're going to get all the best celebrity interviews, so, and cosplay photography, so, yeah. November, we'll see you in uh, New Orleans at Big Easy Con, Nola, so, to all the uh, New Orleans fans, but, yeah, so tonight, we're going to be talking about Spider-Man, we're going to be uh, doing the uh, movie review, is uh, for Spider-Man Far From Home. And, uh, you know, usually when uh, Marvel or DC or, you know, anybody puts a movie out, you give it a couple weeks after it hits digital, make sure it hits Blu-ray before you try to do a movie review. That way you don't give spoilers, because by the time, if it's like a week after the uh, it hits Blu-ray, then that's just on you, if there's any spoilers, in my opinion. But, uh, yeah. Um... So a lot of things I thought it was funny in this, uh, in this, you know, Spider-Man Far From Home, we're going to show the trailer in a sec, you know, and then clip as always, but talking about it, it's, uh, it's kind of funny, uh, I did want to, uh, it made me laugh, it really did, because, uh, there's so many people, you know, thank God all the fans of, uh, Comic Insider actually sometimes for comic books because there's so many people when this you know and before this movie came out uh and there was you know a lot of our competitors that would say all stuff of how mysterio is going to be this big hero and all that and it's like wow did you never read the comics because in the comics uh, one thing i really like about this movie is in the comics the uh you know the guy that's the villain mysterio Yes, he did try to play it off as a hero at first. He's one of the original Sinister Six, which is pretty awesome. He's not the one that recruited the Sinister Six, I think, uh, or the one that was the first villain. I think Vulture was the first villain, but uh, and like Mysterio was like the second. But Doc Ock, you know, a whole another conversation. Doc Ock was the one that assembled them originally in the comics. But in the comics, though, it's pretty cool because. You got right here, the dude was originally, uh, you know, a stuntman, an effects artist, and it was unappreciated, and ended up trying to uh, cause a lot of chaos to look like a good guy, and end up being, you know, bad guy, Spider-Man stopped, and yada yada, and everybody's like, no, he's, they saw the trailer, they're like, oh, Mysterio's a good guy, that, that, that just cracked me up, no more spoilers on that. Let's get to the trailer, because this is a pretty good movie. I mean, I gotta say, if you read the comics, I mean, you already know pretty much a lot of the plot. 
And, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it was an awesome movie. I mean, Tom Holland did a great job as Spider-Man once again. And for all those people who are like, oh, no, that whole Marvel Sony thing. Oh, no, no, they pulled the contracts. That actually might be good for the Venom movies, you know, the sequel coming up. It might have even been planned. I mean, come on, y'all. Let's get to this right now. So, there's a lot of stuff in this trailer, you know, in this movie that just... The Spider-Man Far From Home trailer is about to play, but if you haven't seen Avengers Endgame yet, stop watching, because there's some serious spoilers about to come. Alright, Tom. But if you have seen Avengers Endgame, enjoy the trailer. Okay, come on, man. Everywhere I go, I see Jeez. his face. Sir, I miss him. Yeah, I miss him too. I don't think Tony would have done what he did if he didn't know that you were going to be here after he was gone. Uh, this really is great movie. I mean... Right there, this cracked me up. You gonna be the next Iron Man then? Well, no, I don't have time. I'm too busy doing your job. Oh! oh I'm Look, burn! No work, because I am going on vacation. <laughs> Superheroes really get vacations. Heads up, Nick Fury's calling me. I don't really want to talk now to him. Now this cracks me up right here. Because if you don't talk to him, then I have to talk. But I want to talk to him. Just he he ghosted Nick Fury's phone calls like eight different times in this movie. And y'all got uh, one thing I will say: spoilers. Even if you've seen the movie, watch the end scene credits. Trust me. There's two, uh... There's two unseen credits. Sent Nick Fury to voicemail? I gotta go. You do not you, ghost Nick Fury. Yeah, you don't ghost We're Nick Fury. Just, uh, We're just talking about the... Truth. Why? I'm here in St. Marco Polo. Oh, I think MJ really likes me. I'm gonna do my first so long. I get it. You're a very difficult person to contact, Spider-Man. The thing that in this movie is crazy, they don't call it the snap. It is. Is Mr. Ben. This takes place and after in game. New world big is from Earth, just not ours. The snap. Earth 686. You're saying there's a multiverse? We have a job yep, to there's do. a multiverse. You're coming with us. There's gotta be something else you can lose. What about Thor? Off world. Captain Marvel, unavailable. Who's the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man? Bitch, please, you've been to space. Right there, bitch, please, you've been to space. That cracks me up. Samuel Jackson is, uh, is, oh my god, they couldn't pick anybody better for Nick Fury. But, uh, yeah, y'all gotta check this movie out. It's pretty awesome. It's, it just, you know, earlier when I was talking about, so many fans thought that uh, Mysterio was gonna be a good guy. That just cracked me up. It's like, well, we know who didn't read the comics. You know, and uh, spoilers. You guys got to check out the uh, those after credit scenes. Because, yeah, Mr. J. John Jason, the dude that hates Spider-Man. is <laughs> back in the movie, so. What do you want, Peter? I want to go back on my trip with the girl who I really like and tell her how I feel. MJ, are you going to Spider-Man? Yep. No, of course not. I mean, it's kind of obvious. You're right, you may not be ready, but this is my responsibility. Saving the world requires strategy. Good movie, though. Sometimes people... I, uh... I'm glad they did it the way they did it. Oh, it's kind of funny. The, the world needs the next Iron Man. Turns out, like I was talking about earlier, the original Mysterio from the comics versus the movie. The original was stunt type, you know, artist, and uh, With Spider-Man, you work with Spider-Man, not with. With. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all gotta check that out, but uh, uh, it's pretty funny because you know in the comics, stun effects artist, and in the movie, uh, those dudes actually work for stunt, you know, Tony Stark, and uh, yeah, the whole uh, 3D imaging, the uh, acronym. Barf. 
<laughs> That's the whole reason why that super villain existed. That, that cracks me up, but. Yeah. Well, let's get right to this clip. Alright, comms check. Can you hear me, kid? Yeah, I can. It's just a little loud out here. I like the new suit. Thanks. Whoa. Peter, you sure that's not real? Yeah. It's just a hundred times bigger than I expected. Still the play? Uh-huh. We need to get high enough so Ben doesn't see me coming. Copy. Stay sticky. Is that happy? Yeah, kid. What is it? We need to have a serious conversation about you and my dad. Right? The look on Happy's face when, uh, you know, Spider-Man said that. That just cracks me up. I mean, throughout the whole movie, one of the awkward, funny things was, you know, the whole Happy and Aunt May scenes. And I gotta say, it's pretty crazy. Aunt May's been getting hotter through the years. Wah, wah. No, uh, but this is definitely, you know, comics are approved. And once again, like I was saying earlier with the, you know, don't be too uh, torn up about the Sony Marvel deal because it probably means that we're going to see Spider-Man in the next Venom movie. And, uh, yeah, it does open up a little bit more doors, but just, God, I just hope they don't mess it up. But, yeah, Comic Insider, check this show out. Hit that subscribe button on YouTube. Share these videos. We're also on Facebook and Instagram you know, in the next couple weeks, so, uh, yeah, and don't forget, we're gonna be at the Big Easy Con with, y'all just gotta look at the guest list, but, we're gonna see our CW friends there, we're gonna be hanging out and partying with Ming Chen, you know, uh, all of our friends from DC and Marvel, y'all gotta check that event out, it's gonna be pretty epic, look it up, that's the Big Easy Con in New Orleans, so, Comic Sire, we're the only channel that has a clean bill of health from uh, Dr. Doom, Dr. Strange, Dr. Fate, Dr. Who, Dr. Wells. Y'all have a great night. We'll see you in the multiverse. We Check out new episodes of Comic Insider every week, Tuesdays and Fridays at 8, 7 Central on YouTube and Facebook. Like and subscribe. We'll see you in the multiverse. <laughs>